Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name's Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary on this game is the former Arn England fullback Lee Dixon. And what we have coming up for you is live action from the Turkish Superliga. I certainly can't wait for this, Lee. Well, thank you, Derek. Glorious atmosphere here. Really looking forward to it. The fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end to end. We could get goals today, Derek. Well, based on the way the visitors defend with such authority and excellence, they're going to be very hard to break down, you just feel, Lee. Well, they've been so solid at the back, Derek, whether it's in front of their own fans or away from home. It comes down to communication. In my day, I always had Tony Adams, David Seaman yelling in my ear, keeping me in line. Hopefully, for the neutral, they concede first. That should open up the game a little. This is how it looks for the home side. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield, a back four, the two full backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre backs. Well, here's how it looks for Galatasaray. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4-5-1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. And this confrontation is underway. Babajide Akintola. Long is with Pablo Santos. An attack full of promise. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defense? Adama Traore. A really effective shielding under pressure. Now he must favour the cross. Ruben Ribeiro. Can they trouble the opposition this time? And very deftly cut out. Kilinch. Well, let's look at this again. We've all hit these in training. First time, bang in the back of the net. Look at the calmness of it. Technique, brilliant. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Babajide Akintola. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. Ruben Ribeiro. Untidy on the ball. Onyekuru. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Opportunity to deliver the cross. Jetson Fernandes. A very effective challenge put in.
Ruben Ribeiro. Really nice ball. And a fine cross. And you need your defender to take charge. Ribeiro. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. And still looking for space. Takes it on. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay. It's a really dangerous ball into the penalty area. And then the brute force and guile in equal amounts sets up the chance to score. And he doesn't disappoint, does he? Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Kilinch. And the ball with Jetson for Nansch. This is looking threatening, and he read it well. Went in strongly, decisively. Duf. Ribeiro. High quality defending. Martin Linez. Henry Onyekuru. And it's with Etebo. Kilinch. Onyekuru. And that is offside. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Moving it forward. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Real chance. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, they say there's no better time to score just before half-time. The team talk of both sides are going to be changing now. It's a good finish, Derek, and they deserve the lead. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Killinch. Promising pass. Killinch. 
chance to cross moving the ball effectively Etebo and the ball with Jetson for Nansch Kilinch and the post coming to the goalkeeper's aid and it crossed the touchline so a throw in here Bayram well when you sit off like this you invite pressure now will the cross work out for them Well, here's the replay, Derek. I love a ball into the box. You know that. It's a beauty. And still with lots to do, he unleashes a very powerful effort. Gave the keeper little chance. Lovely goal that was. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Half an hour remaining then. It is to be a throw-in. And the substitution will occur now. Pablo Santos. Galatasaray have had the lion's share of possession. If you don't control the ball in midfield, it's very difficult to have enough of the ball to create chances for your strikers. And really has been a dominant performance. It is a decent looking attack here. Cross could be useful. Real chance. Oh, that's a fine save. A corner will ensue. Over it comes. Falcao. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Babo. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Fifteen minutes remaining. And the keeper can gather. Falcao. And back with Falcao. Can he take the chance? Shielding the ball superbly. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. A oh, fine reading of the situation. Might be onto something with that ball. Burmer Bayram. Falcao. Oh, that's a super ball over the top. Incredible instinctive goalkeeping. Yeah, he didn't have long to react, did he? But you have to praise his reflexes there.
They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. So the corner played into the box. No nonsense clearance. Falcao has it. Nicely cut out. And we are going to have two additional. Ruben Ribeiro. It's opening up for them. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Lee, what did you make of it? Well, we highlighted how good their defence was before the game. And you have to say, they have forwards who know where the goals are too. Pretty decent unit all round, you have to say. The manager will be thrilled by this win. Easy game, isn't it, Derek?